hey guys it's me here from tickdoid for you so in this tutorial i'm going to create this so let's get started so first of all open the photoshop and take a new page 8 by 10 with 300 pixel per inch now go to this elliptical marquee tool and select it hold shift and alt key on the keyboard and drag the mouse to create a circle like this so like this now you have to choose the gradient option and here you have to make a gradient color so choose the color bright yellow color and on the other side something like orange like this hit the ok button and now you have to choose the this radical gradient tool and hold the shift key and drag to fill the gradient in it so i am keeping the yellow in the middle and the orange the outside like this press ctrl d to remove the selection now right click on this layer choose go to the blending options and here you have to click on this devil and emboss to give it an effect something like this make choose the depth 147 percent and the size is 33 and opacity and shadow mode you have to simply adjust according to your need so simply hit ok now take a new layer choose the text option and here i am choosing so here i have chosen this font called power keys so you can search in the internet so this is the font and i have also changed the alphabet to w and uh, you could press the ctrl t on the keyboard and you can easily transform it so that this cursor changes to this as you can see two arrows and rotate your font like this as you can see and you can adjust it simply for easy editing i am going to rasterize this right click on this font type layer and click on rasterize type now press ctrl t press shift and alt to resize according to your requirement so that's it now i'm going to change the color of it to purple press alt and backspace to change the color to purple now right click on it go to blending option and again click on bevel and emboss and from here you have to choose the inner bevel adjust the deafness and the size So and the directions will be upward. Now I'm going to give a drop shadow into it with reduced opacity and the size as well. Distance something like this. And this is the setting which you have to do. Now press control on the keyboard and click on this layer to make the selection now take a new layer and go to brush tool and right click and choose the brush which hardness will be zero use the bracket keys on the keyboard to adjust the size of the brush and choose the color from here see i'm choosing the purple curl and just increase the size of the brush and move it like this now go to the color selection tool and change the color to red and now again you have to make something like this you could also give a drop shadow to this outer circle to make it more attractive simply reduce the opacity and the size And that's it this is the simple logo which i had just created it you could experiment with these settings as well 
so if you have any question you can ask in the comment box below that's all in this video friend i'll see you in the next video if you enjoyed this video friends drop a like leave a comment if you have any questions to ask and subscribe to this channel now as more exciting videos coming up and do share this video with your friends and family this is Shivam signing off